I'm in focus. Panasonic, Panasonic. Yes, my friends, there is a way. There is a way to get good autofocus continuous while filming videos with the Lumix S cameras. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to do it. This video is gonna be filmed with the Panasonic Lumix S1 and the 24105 f4, uh, 24 millimeters, and I'm gonna use continuous autofocus. So we're gonna also see how the autofocus performs with these settings that I'm using. And believe it or not, this hack works also with the full frame sensor, V-Log 4K 24, 25, and 30 frames per second. I know, it's mind blowing, but yeah, it works. By the way, did you already check the previous video that I released where I share tips and tricks to get good out of focus with the Lumix S cameras? If you didn't, have a look. I will put the link in the description and up here or there somewhere in the frame. The funny thing about all of this is that there is not really an hack. It's basically a simple setting that you should turn on every time you start to record your subject with the Lumix S camera. I don't know why Panasonic didn't really enable it automatically when you start to film. It's something that you have to do every time you film uh, your main subject and every time the subject is going outside from the frame and it's coming back. Do you want to know it? For sure. It is pretty simple. So simple that nobody talks about it. And I'm seeing many reviewers doing this uh, autofocus testing without enabling this setting. So I decided to make this video to finally solve this big uh, problem of autofocus in video with the Lumix S cameras. And here it is. Every time you see the yellow box floating around the face of your main subject, every time you have to confirm the autofocus tracking for that subject. So you're gonna see a difference in that box. Um, without the tracking, it's gonna be sort of empty. And when you're gonna track the subject, uh, you're gonna confirm it. You're gonna see four intersec intersecting. Oh, what's the word of that matte stuff? So you're gonna see some little lines around the box and that's the confirmation that the subject is gonna be tracked. To enable this tracking function, you have to press the joystick to confirm that the subject is the one you wanna track, or you have to use the touch screen. I know, sounds too stupid, but doing this is gonna enable the autofocus continuous for video with the Lumix S cameras. Amazing. I don't know if this is gonna work also for the GH5 or GH5S, but let me know in the comment below if this system is working well for you or not. Also, if you can write what camera and lens you are using, it's gonna help people to understand which combination of uh, camera and lens works uh, with this system. It will be really helpful for all of us, the community. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you next time. Probably with another camera, because vlogging with the Lumix S1 is a little bit uh, too heavy and cumbersome. So I decided to buy uh, a new camera. So if you're curious to know what camera I'm gonna buy, Stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Ciao.